Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome if you're new. In today's video, I'm just going to be talking to you about gifts for special occasions, the rule of four. So I came across this a while back about how there should be four things that you gift on a special occasion. For example, birthdays, which is the one that I think about the most. So when it comes to birthdays, for example, you should gift something they want, something they need, something to wear, something to read. So for example, my daughter just had um, her birthday, my oldest daughter had her birthday and I've had these gifts prepared in advance and something she wanted or was interested in was um, horses. She's been really into horses because of Spirit the Horse. I don't know if you guys know who I'm talking about, but she's been really interested so I figured she would want to play with these horses because she's really excited for them so I got her something she wanted then something she needed was like a warm pair of pajamas that wasn't like a onesie because she does have like those um those entire like PJs that cover the feet with the little zipper and all of that so I got her one that was just a top and a pants separately so that she could wear sometimes on those cozy days for home and she doesn't have to unzip herself fully to go potty. So I thought that was great, something to wear. Okay, so I got ahead of myself, but I finally figured it out. It's um, something they want, something they need, right? Something to wear and something to read. What she needed was some undies, so I did get her some. So that's basically what she needed. She needed some um new ones so i got her that and then something to wear would be the pajama set that i just mentioned i was a little confused i was like i know i have two clothing items what why am i getting mixed up but yes something she needed was the undies and then something to wear was the warm cozy pjs and then something to read she's been into um daniel tiger like at the beginning of last year she was very into daniel tiger and we got her a book at some point last year so we gifted her that as well so again those four things something they want something they need something to wear something to read so in this case again I got her the horses because she's really interested in that so I believe it's something she would have wanted something she needed was some undergarments something to wear is the PJs around the house and we'll for those cozy days when she needs a set that she can just pull off easily to be able to use the potty, like I said. And then something to read, which is the Daniel Tiger book, which I will probably read to her before I tuck her into bed. And that will help her. So those were simple. Those are the gifts that she basically got. Although I had picked up one gift, um, maybe three months or two months before giving birth to my youngest and that was a karaoke machine it was on sale back when Toys R Us was closing or shutting down so I picked that up and it's just been sitting around the house and she has seen it plenty of times but she didn't really know what it was and she got that today I figured yes it's the rule of four but this was a very special gift because as of like the past month maybe she's been singing a lot of songs from movies and shows and she's been really into singing and I thought you know what this kind of goes into something she needs besides the undies I feel like she needed this to be able to develop her voice and be able to sing and practice and just have a totally different experience so yes I count that as a need because it's gonna help with her development with her speech from from her singing with her memory from trying to remember these lyrics so i think it's going to be something awesome <laughs> remember if you like this video please leave it a thumbs up and if you haven't subscribed already please subscribe thank you guys for watching see you next time